A nonsteroidal antiandrogen NSAA, is an antiandrogen with a nonsteroidal chemical structure. They are typically selective and full or silent antagonists of the androgen receptor R, and act by directly blocking the effects of androgens like testosterone and dihydrotestosterone DHT. NSAAs are used in the treatment of androgen-dependent conditions in men and women. They are the converse of steroidal antiandrogens SAS, which are antiandrogens that are steroids and are structurally related to testosterone. Medical uses NSAAs are used in clinical medicine for the following indications Prostate cancer in men Androgen-dependent skin and hair conditions like acne, hirsutism, seborrhea, and pattern hair loss androgenic alopecia, in women. Hyperandrogenism, such as due to polycystic ovary syndrome or congenital adrenal hyperplasia, in women. As a component of hormone therapy for transgender women. Precocious puberty in boys. Priapism in men. Pharmacology Unlike SAS, NSAAs have little or no capacity to activate the R, show no off-target hormonal activity such as progestogenic, glucocorticoid, or antimineralocorticoid activity, and lack antigonadotropic effects. For these reasons, they have improved efficacy and selectivity as antiandrogens and do not lower androgen levels, instead acting solely by directly blocking the actions of androgens at the level of their biological target, the R. List of NSAAs Marketed First generation Flutamide, Ulexin, marketed for the treatment of prostate cancer and also used in the treatment of acne, hirsutism, and hyperandrogenism in women. It has also been studied in the treatment of benign prostatic hyperplasia. Now little used due to high incidences of elevated liver enzymes and hepatotoxicity and the availability of safer agents. Nilutamide, Anandrin, Nilandrin, marketed for the treatment of prostate cancer. Very little used due to a high incidence of interstitial pneumonitis and high rates of several unique and unfavorable side effects such as nausea and vomiting, visual disturbances, and alcohol intolerance. Bicalutamide, Casidex, marketed for the treatment of prostate cancer and also used in the treatment of hirsutism in women, as a component of hormone therapy for transgender women, to delay precocious puberty in boys, to prevent or alleviate priapism, and for other indications. It has also been studied in the treatment of benign prostatic hyperplasia. By far the most widely used NSAA, due to its favorable profile of efficacy, tolerability, and safety. Topolutamide, eucopil, also known as fluoridyl. Marketed as a topical medication for the treatment of pattern hair loss androgenic alopecia in the Czech Republic and Slovakia. Limited availability and lack of an oral formulation for systemic use make it a very little known drug. Second generation Apalutamide, Erlita, marketed for the treatment of prostate cancer. Very similar to enzalutamide, but with reduced central nervous system distribution and hence is expected to have a reduced risk of seizures and other central side effects. Enzalutamide, Extandi, marketed for the treatment of prostate cancer. More effective than the first-generation NSAAs due to increased efficacy and potency and shows no risk of elevated liver enzymes or hepatotoxicity. However, it has a small, 1% risk of seizures and has central nervous system side effects like anxiety and insomnia due to off-target inhibition of the GABAA receptor that the first-generation NSAAs do not have. In addition, it has prominent drug interactions due to moderate to strong induction of multiple cytochrome P450 enzymes. Currently on patent with no generic availability and hence is very expensive. Miscellaneous Cimetidine, Tagamet, an over-the-counter histamine H2 receptor antagonist that also shows very weak activity as an R antagonist. Also inhibits cytochrome P450 enzymes and thereby inhibits hepatic estradiol metabolism and increases circulating estradiol levels. It has been investigated in the treatment of hirsutism but showed minimal effectiveness. 
sometimes causes gynecomastia as a rare side effect. Nonsteroidal androgen synthesis inhibitors like ketoconazole can also be described as NSAAs, although the term is usually reserved to describe R antagonists. Not marketed. Under development. Darilutamide, ODM-201, Bay 1841788, a second-generation NSAA. It is under development for the treatment of prostate cancer. Structurally distinct from enzalutamide, apalutamide, and other NSAAs. Relative to enzalutamide and apalutamide, shows greater efficacy as an R antagonist, improved activity against mutated R variants in prostate cancer, little or no inhibition or induction of cytochrome P450 enzymes, and little or no central nervous system distribution. However, has a much shorter terminal half-life and lower potency. Proxalutamide, GT0918, a second-generation NSAA. It is under development for the treatment of prostate cancer. Similar to enzalutamide and apalutamide, but with increased efficacy as an R antagonist, little or no central nervous system distribution, and no induction of seizures in animals. Seviteronal VT-464 is a nonsteroidal androgen biosynthesis inhibitor which is under development for the treatment of prostate cancer. Development discontinued. Chodorinol, CPC10997, Cyoctyl, Ethicin, X Andron, a structurally unique first generation NSAA. It was under development as an oral medication for the treatment of benign prostatic hyperplasia and as a topical medication for the treatment of acne and pattern hair loss. It reached phase 2 and phase 3 clinical trials for these indications prior to discontinuation due to insufficient effectiveness. Inacoterone acetate, RU38882, RU882, a steroid-like NSAA. It was under development as a topical medication for the treatment of acne but was discontinued due to insufficient effectiveness in clinical trials. RU58841, PSK3841, HMR3841, a first-generation NSAA related to nilutamide. It was under development as a topical medication for the treatment of acne and pattern hair loss but its development was discontinued during phase 1 clinical trials. See also Selective androgen receptor modulator N-terminal domain antiandrogen Discovery and development of antiandrogens Nonsteroidal estrogen. References. Further reading. Teutsch G, Galbid F, Batman T, Von Fies A, Bushu F, Sarid E, Gofflo D, Gaillard Kelly M, Philibert D, 1994. Non-steroidal antiandrogens, synthesis and biological profile of high affinity ligands for the androgen receptor. J. Steroid Biochem. Mole, Bile, 48, 1, 111 to 9. DOI 10.1016-0960-0760-94-90257-7. PMID 8136296. Singh S. M., Godier S., Labrie F. 2000. Androgen Receptor Antagonists, Antiandrogens, Structure Activity Relationships. Kerr. Med. Chem. 7, 2, 211-47. doi 101 PMID 10637363. Iverson P., Melizinic I., Schmidt A. 2001. Nonsteroidal Antiandrogens, a Therapeutic Option for Patients with Advanced Prostate Cancer Who Wish to Retain Sexual Interest and Function. BJU Int. 87, 47-56. J. 1464-410 Extension 2001.00988, X. PMID 
Klotz L., Schellhammer P. 2005. Combined Androgen Blockade, The Case for Bicalutamide. Clin Prostate Cancer, 3, 4, 215-9. doi, 10.3816, cgc.2005, n.002. PMID 15882477. Gao W., Kim J., Dalton J. T. 2006. Pharmacokinetics and Pharmacodynamics of Nonsteroidal Androgen Receptor Ligands. Farm. Res. 23, 8, 1641 58. doi 10.1007 per seconds 1109 5 3. PMC 2072875. PMID 16841196. Lu B., Su L., Zheng J., Lu J., Zhao G. Developments in Nonsteroidal Antiandrogens Targeting the Androgen Receptor. Chemedchem. 510, 1651-61. DOI 10.1002, CMDC.2010002259. PMID 20,853,390. Kunath F., Grobe H. R., Rucker G., Mochel E., Antes G., Dom P., Wolich B., Mirpal J. J. Non-steroidal antiandrogen monotherapy compared with luteinizing hormone releasing hormone agonists or surgical castration monotherapy for advanced prostate cancer, a Cochrane Systematic Review. BJU Int. 116, 1, 30-6. doi, 10.1111, BJU.13026. PMID 25523493. Core P. Katik G. L. 2016. Advancements in non-steroidal antiandrogens as potential therapeutic agents for the treatment of prostate cancer. Mini Rev Med Chem, 16, 7, 531 to 46. Doi 10.2174 1 septillion 389 sextillion 557 quintillion 516 quadrillion 666 trillion 160 billion 118 million 112,448. PMID 26,776,222.